Hi, this is Dr. Pramod Krishnan. I'm a consultant neurologist at Manipal Hospital, Bangalore. I specialize in epilepsy. Anti-epileptic drugs remain the most important cornerstone of treatment of epilepsy or seizures. Most patients can be treated with just a single kind of anti-epileptic medications. When that fails, multiple medicines may need to be used simultaneously. There may be a certain subset of patients where even the medicines do not achieve full seizure control, in which case we need to look at other options. Ketogenic diet is a special form of diet that can be used along with the anti-epileptic medications to bring about seizure control. We have more complicated and expensive electronic devices called vagus nerve stimulation, responsive neurostimulation, which can also be used to control epilepsy. They are expensive and are applicable in only a small number of patients. If we can identify the exact area of the brain from where the seizure arises, then that particular part of the brain can be surgically removed and this is called epilepsy surgery. Epilepsy surgery can be offered to only those patients where the MRI and the EEG show a definite area of abnormality. And when such surgery is done in a proper manner, we could actually see the patient being cured of epilepsy and over a period of time, even the medications may be stopped. Every patient who is not responding to medicines need to consider a surgical option as well. They need to go through several additional tests before a decision regarding surgery can be arrived at. Very few centers in the country offer epilepsy surgery and even in Manipal we do epilepsy surgery on a regular basis. It is expensive and it involves removing a part of the brain but the complication rate is very low and the results are exceedingly good.